can you sort of explain to us what's going on here? Sure. Uh, to let you know, we are from RBC. We are here for their Blue Water Project, which is all about water conservation and sustainability practices. RBC is actually partnered up with Flick Off, which is an organization that promotes different environmental issues as well, and ways that students and people in Canada in general can uh, make a difference in the environment and cut back on their usage, such as like switching to bikes. Or what we're here to hopefully do is get people to flick off bald water. So with that being said, what it is, is on average, uh, Canadians drink about 60 liters of bald water a year, which is about 120 bottles of water, which is a lot of environmental damage. And if you guys can see on the back of this display, there's actually 120 water bottles, so you can see how much waste it really is. So what we're trying to do today is we have these beautiful stainless steel um, reusable water container so we're doing a bottle water swap swap so in exchange for your bottled water we're going to give you a reusable container we're asking people three questions what they know about the environment just to get an idea of what students think and what their opinion on certain topics are question one is how much of the water in the world is fresh water accessible for human use the answer is one percent yeah. and the last one of the following what causes the most water pollution the answer is b illegal disposal of oil and sewers and waterways yeah so Really interesting, um, and thank you guys for participating. So in exchange, here is your beautiful stainless steel reusable water container. The big thing, the exciting part, is uh, we're here for a concert. There's the Constantines playing, as well as Spiral Beach. We have speakers from the David Suzuki Foundation. Sarah Harmer's one of them. And basically what we're doing is, again, we're trying to help students learn more about environmental issues and how they can make a difference, because we are you know, the generation that has to really step up. And the big thing that we're here for is, again, promoting flick off bottled water and sustainable water uses. <laughs> So I'm standing here with Brian from the Constantine. So tell me, how does it feel to be back in London? It feels good. I, I, it's nice to be back on campus in the fall. I feel that kind of anxiety of, of uh, yeah, back to school and midterm time and stuff at the moment, just from the surroundings. But it's good to be here. So I have to ask, how are you guys involved? How are the Constantines involved with the Flick Off initiative? Or the people who are organizing the, uh, the Flick Off campaign contacted our our label and asked if we'd be interested in doing it and it, uh, we were definitely interested it seemed like a great great thing to be involved with how do you personally flick off um, you know I'm, I'm a composter a recycler and I, and I uh, you know I don't don't really drive very much. I bike as much as possible. I think bicycles are one of the greatest uh, developments of, of human civilization. You know, you know. So I'm, uh, that's that's the biggest one for me. But I'm just I'm also just here to kind of learn as well. You know. Okay, and this is a bit off topic, but your music was featured on One Tree Hill, as probably many of our viewers know. How has that helped promote the Constantines, and how has it helped promote your music and get your message out there? Um, I think, you know, just uh, very literally just gets our music to more people. Like, we, and it was nice. We, uh, the producer of that show was a fan, and, and he just, you know, put it put it on there. And, and yeah, definitely. I think more people have probably come to see us because they heard that song on, on that show. pisses you off the most about how people mistreat the environment? You know what, I really hate it when people litter. Honestly, I'm just driving down the road and I see like a cigarette package fly out the window. I hate it. Pisses me off. Just laziness is all it is. <laughs> pisses me off. I know people litter a lot and um, I guess that's pretty bothersome, like especially when there's like garbage bins pretty much everywhere. Have you ever wondered what the USC does and what it has to offer for Western students? Well, stay tuned after the break while I get the opportunity to speak with Stephen Lecce and get an insight on the USC.